Last week we took the caravan in to get repaired. The springs were quite bad, so they need replacing. And also the brackets that were supporting the springs were in a bad way as well. So we got those repaired and then we had a look at doing some work in the camper van. It looks like work on the camper van is going to come to a stop before it even starts. And there's a very good reason for this. The caravan is back. <laughs> so I'm really, really pleased about that. So we've now got new wheel bearings. The springs were re-tempered and the bracket that you saw the little split in it was actually a cut out from i believe someone had a grinding wheel in there and that has been completely replaced and they've put in a steel bracket uh, which was originally about six six mil thick and they change it for a 10 mil thick and that's where the spring actually sits on and also the nuts on the inside, they have actually welded them to that bracket. So now it's all lovely and secure. So everything's looking up, caravan's all done, so it's nice and even now, so that's really good. Um, so slight change of plans, I'm gonna do a bit more work on the caravan. And when I get a chance, I'll do some more work on, on the camper. So um, yeah, that's really good news. So. Very pleased about that, so we'll crack on to it. Now, one of the things I do before I work in the back part of the caravan is to put the stays down, obviously, but I also lower the front of the caravan, um, lower it so that the front is lower than the back uh, because I'm working up in, in this area. So, first thing to do, wind up the jacks. The object of this exercise is that the base that we've got in this caravan is very very heavy and it was used as part of a rock and roll bed system um, and we just don't need all that weight anymore. So I'm going to take the mattress out, take these two massively heavy bases off, um, basically take all the internal framing out and put a couple of sheets of ply in and have it sort of so it's hinged. So that's the plan. So the first thing I'm going to do is take this off, measure up how much ply I need and go get some. Also what I forgot to mention is the reason why we're doing this exercise is that since we've had the caravan we installed these two fridges in, the medic fridges and they add extra weight to the back. Also, we've done a couple of other things which added weight to the back of the caravan. So we'll just have a look at those. Here we go. And here's a couple of other things that we've added. Um, the spare tire frame on the back, all this racking system, plus also the tube for all our um, awning poles. So those add a lot of weight to the back of the caravan. So what I'm intending to do is lighten up the bed inside. Uh, another thing I want to do later on is take this out and transfer that to the front. That'll lighten up the back of the caravan, which will make it hopefully a lot better for towing as well. And also 
less strain on the back of the springs because as you would have seen probably in one of the earlier videos they were sagging quite a bit and were worn out and it could be due to the all excess weight that was in the back area here because they were facing down like this in this area so to do the bed is the first thing um, I think we'll do that before we head off um, and that'll take care of some of the weight if I get time I'll do the pole a bit later on so um, yeah let's get on with it all right so here's the mattress off and I took it off and I dropped the table down in the front of the cabin and put the mattress there to find that it actually fits perfectly in the front part of the caravan, which is excellent. Good morning, life. Good morning, sun. How are you? Skies above. Gee, it's great to be alive and love. Good morning, sun. Right, there you are. That's with the Bed bases removed, and oh my god, were they heavy! <laughs> anyway, what I can do now is be because we're going to have the ply screwed down all the way around here, there's no need for the diagonal bracing anymore. So, next part is to take that out, and uh, we should carry on from there. I'm sort of half and half wondering where to leave that in. I might actually leave it in. As a center support but um, as you would have seen in previous videos this is all well and truly supported both in the front at the back so um, yeah we shall carry on stripping this down right there's the frame all stripped down and we're ready to go and get the plywood now Right, the first thing I'm going to do here is just fill in through here on both sides so that when the sheets apply lying this way they don't end up sagging down in between so put a couple through here so make a start on that Right, so there's the, um, the base of the bed now all made up and this first section, I'm going to eventually put the struts in, in there. And it'll be hinged back to about this part here. So making progress. So next step I've got to do is um, just make some markings. And then I'm going to draw some ventilation holes across, across the bed base. The, um, and then I've got to put a trim along the front here so I'd better get on with it right one of the first things I did was I'm gonna weigh these boards to see the difference between what I'm doing with the new board and uh, compare that to the old boards that are over there so yeah well uh, so I've been on the scales and I weigh <laughs> So now I'm going to pick up this one and we'll get away to this one. So here we go. And the weight I've got 99 kg on that one. All right. So now I'm going to do it with the old one. Right, I hope the scales have got enough room. <laughs> so here we go. A hundred and seven point seven. Whew. So what's that about? Nearly um what was the first one? <laughs> anyway. Um so that's only one half of the beard. 
So I'm going to go through the process with the other half of the bed as well. So we're going to save some more weight. Wait. So now I can now assemble this into the back of the caravan. All right. <laughs> Here we go with the second panel. So I already know that I weigh 40 kgs. <laughs> so here we go. This one is 104.3. 104.3. So that one. So now I'm just going to stick this back in the caravan and uh, sand up the edges, tidy it up a bit. Screw them down, well, especially the back one, but not this one because it's going to have the um, struts on. So, great. Right, this is the, is the equivalent of the one I've just done. Um, so now I'm going to see how much this weighs. I hope it goes up that far. <laughs> right, here we go. Exactly 110 kgs. Wow. So, I think we may save quite a bit. So there's the bed all made up. So the back, back half up to this line is screwed in. And then this part here is just free floating at the moment. Um, because it's going to be on struts so you can use this little pull cord here to lift it up there you go straight down again <laughs> <laughs>